So we are going to demonstrate how do we do this again? And we also want you to do something else and to uh, to to use this measurable. All right. So let's see how we do it. So first, I have a measurable. The measurable only get measure. That's easy. Just get measure. All right. But you want to do get measure. If you want to do get measure. You have to, your bank account has to implement measurable. So, and I need to have get measure here in my balance. Okay, so that's bank account. I got a country here. The country need to have a name and area and also get measure. Okay, also get measure. Is okay? Then I write a student here and also get measure. And later you, you need to write one for me. Is okay? So now we do the measurable test. We do the measurable test. And we use another, we, this one we must use another uh, method right here. And this method will take the class. Only the object will take the, only the object which you must implement the measurable. Otherwise, we cannot work with you. We can work with you because you have to be in the measurable country. You are in this measurable, you already implement measurable, so you, we can use you. So, notice, notice, uh, you know, account. Uh, already taken so we can take bank account notice student already taken so we can do the student account then we want to do country right now all right we do the country right now so I am going to do uh, countries and zero all right so we're going to uh, equal new country is that right so ours is called country so make sure you call country okay and the country is going to um, have two things okay one is the name is that right so let's do la la land all right la la land the area let's don't do uh, 2000 square feet whatever okay I got a la la land right now. All right. So can anyone give me another country? Do me a favor. You don't need to do real country because no country is 2,000 square feet. You understand? All right. Tattooing. Okay, good. Where's that anyway? That's a, a, a good country's name. Can you write the whole thing for me so I can uh, Star War? Okay, fine, fine. Uh, okay. From con from all right, so we got another country from the Star War. So new country, all right, and is a uh, ta tuning. Oh, is that right? Or do I say it right? Okay, make this four thousand square feet. Okay. So now remember, these they have to become a measurable thing. Is that right? All right, so then you know the country has to be part of the measurable thing. Now we can do this right now. We say double average area equal then average. Okay, then I am going to put country. Is that okay, I'm going to put country right there. Then do I spell right? Yes, okay, so I'm um, this. Uh, I'm going to say um, average uh, con uh, mm, uh, average area of the countries the these uh, fancy countries because they are not real, con real countries all right then hold on I, I need to have that thing too 
and this average area. Is okay? Do I spell right? Terrible. No. Right? Okay. So far, okay. Right now, so I build it, I run as a Java application. All right. So right here, I got these right now. The average balance is that, average grade is that, and average area of fancy land is 3,000. So far, okay, do you understand? Now, look, so these will be why we use a measurable. Because once we use measurable right here, as long as you, now, rule number one is you have to become a, a inside a measurable world. Once you become the inside measurable world right there, then you do get measured right here. Then, so I have a bank account, I implement measure. I have a country, I implement measure. I have a, a student, I uh, implement measure. Once I do that, then I, I inside my class, inside my measurable task, I create my own, I create my own uh, method. This method is, hey, I'm, I will, I, you can be average as long as, as long as you are uh, one of the measurable world. You are in one of the measurable world. Do you understand this program or not? Yes or no? Yes or no? Do you understand this program? Okay, yes. I hope you like this.